Hey guys, welcome back everyone to my Heracross Soul Run, and today we are going to go through the lighthouse and uh, battles and trainers train up for the next uh, gym, which is a fine type gym. If you all enjoy this episode, please hit that like button and subscribe for more. Your support is greatly appreciated. And guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed this part of the video. And uh, remember, God first, God bless, and have fun every day that you do. Now let's get on with part 7, y'all. So, we still have our solo runner. Heracross, named Cross, level 35, knows moves, Horror Attack, Fury Cutter, uh, Attracted Counter, and we have our, like, HM Slaves, just because we need to get around the region. Yeah, this is the Lighthouse, you need to go in here, um, to battle trainers, and also meet the gym leader of this town, Jasmine, who specializes in steel types. Oh, this is no place for playing. Okay, what does he have? Knocked out a flying type, should be okay. Yeah, we're so high leveled. Um, but yeah, guys, hope you guys are having a good day today. I did. I went to a uh, Cracker Barrel today, actually. Had the, uh, chicken BLT with, like, some special sauce on it. I'm not sure. It was really good. I enjoyed it. It's actually one of my... I think that's going to be, like, one of my new favorite sandwiches, actually. I'm going to go there next time just by myself. Yeah, but we're just going to go through this lighthouse. These trainers aren't that hard. If you have a really good mon or a strong mon, like, even, like, if you're running, like, a full team and you're, like, a little 30s, you should be okay. Yeah, this lighthouse is not that bad at all. You're just going up here to meet the gym leader. Now, for a shortcut, you want to go to the left to see the gym leader, but I'm actually going to bow to some other trainers. Just to get as much levels as I can for the champion at the end of the game. Just so I can avoid as much grinding as possible. But I don't know if Heracross is going to learn any fighting type moves, which is very unfortunate. So I might have to get one from uh, the next gym leader. Which I guess is okay. It's an okay thing. Um, this is Team 34, that is... Can he learn Shadow Ball? No. I know you can learn Swagger, though, but Swagger ain't that good. Can I learn Strength? Yeah. Strength isn't a good move. I'm actually gonna forget Horn Attack for it. It's much po much more powerful than, uh... Fire Runner Candy right there to level up Pokemon once. Jasmine is the city's gym leader. I mean, to bring her back with me, nobody had better get in my way. Wow, you're a big Jasper fan, huh? Meryl, let's see how much strength does. Yeah, it's one at KO. Yeah, guys, um, this solo run's probably going to take an easy turn until we get to uh, Jasmine. Um, and also the champion, but... I mean, we should be able to be okay. Um, a chop, not a big deal. Now, guys, I understand the, hair, uh, the Emerald Nuzlocke did not end up... Like the way that I intended, um, but I will be back to that playthrough maybe a little bit later on when I get uh, bigger, get more people watching. I just put like a flashback where I lost the second gym leader Raleigh. That was embarrassing. So basically, what Jasmine set up there was we have to go to the next town and get a medicine for her um, because the Pokemon that she's watching up there is sick. In order to use Surf, I'm actually going to catch a Pokemon real quick. Um, to learn it, we're gonna, uh, he cannot learn Surf. Dang it. Okay, to make this easier, I'm just gonna move this to the top. Come on, give me something other than Magikarp, come on. Give me something other than Magikarp. Thank you, okay, you can learn Surf. Uh, we're just gonna spam Pokeballs until he can go in, okay. Uh, we're just gonna name you... Surf. Uh, surf. There we go. Right, we're going to heal up. And now we're going to go to our next town. So to get to the next town, you have to go down here on Route 40. And I had to teach him Surf. Which I have, right? I do have that. I got it last episode, I'm pretty sure. Or two episodes ago. And we're just going to forget any move because we're not using him. Alright, we can Surf now on water. Look at that, guys. And there's a bunch of trainers on this route. Mostly use Tentacles, Tentacruels, um, Chen Chows. Some use Remoraid, some use Staryu. Shelter, a bunch of water types on this route. So, well, obviously, you're on the water. I mean, well, you're not going to find any fire types here, that's for sure. Uh, tentacle, dead. Um, shelter, dead. War Turtle, dead. Okay. So I guess I'll just talk about a few things while I'm doing this. I'm actually doing a Us series right now, my Yukio series. I really hope you guys are enjoying those. I really love them. Um, I think the schedule coming up after that, I think after I get done with one of these playthroughs, I'm just going to finish up the other two. 
and uh, start maybe one or two other series just so I don't feel overworked and I, I can still produce the best content I can do for all you lovely people out there uh, okay I'm out uh, Fury Cutter yeah but Heracross is really good at late game especially it's really the flying type and ghost type gym where I was worried but it looks like we're not having any problems taking down uh, people at all. Uh, we're just flying by through this game. I mean, it's only part seven. We're already to the fifth gym leader. I mean, we are going to beat this game probably very soon. Uh, the water's warm here. I'm loose and limber. Sure, I'll take you on. So you're going to bow me in the water with your water types. Shelter, dead. Come on, give me a real challenge, man. Oh, yeah, Tentacruel, the involved form. But we should take it out, like, in one hit. There we go. Um, Tentacle, dead. Oh my gosh, yeah, if you don't have repels, like, everywhere that you walk is a wild encounter, basically. I'm just showing you guys where all the trainers are. Um, and it, also, that rare candy we picked up increases the Pokemon's level by one, so we're just going to do that real quick. Um, no. So this is Cyanwood City. This is the home of the fifth gym leader, uh, Chuck. Yeah, I, I like the name that they gave him, Chuck. Just because Chuck is such a good name for a fighter. Uh, so to get the medicine for the sick Pokemon of Lighthouse, you actually need to go in here. Your Pokemon appear to be fine. Is something worrying you? The Lighthouse Pokemon is in trouble. I got it. This ought to do the trick. My secret potion is a tad too strong. I only offered to in an emergency. Yeah, so there's the secret potion. You need to bring that back to the Lighthouse. If you go in here, he'll give you a prized Pokemon. It's a, a shuckle. It's actually really bad. I'll show you why. I'm actually going to take his item. So what what its main gimmick is, look at that defense and look at its attack. It's a great staller. So like in competitive battles, you can put Toxic on it, Stealth Rock, set up moves and stuff like that. But we're not going to use him. And actually, we're going to deposit everyone besides Krabby because we, we don't need anyone else um, for HMs anyway. So we're going to do that. So if you go up here, you'll find a sweet coon. Yo, one god. Wasn't that sweet coon just now? I only caught a quick glance, but I thought I saw a sweet coon running on the waves. Sweet coon is beautiful and grand, and it races through towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. I want to see sweet coon up close. I've decided. I'll bow you as a trainer to earn sweet coon's respect. Come on, one god. Let's battle now. Yeah, so East Wing, uh, you seen will battle you for sweet coon's respect, but. Come on, this guy's got nothing on us. We got hair across level 40. We get, well, I mean, we packed this guy with a bunch, the best, the best uh, rare candies ever, the man's ever seen, and I can't hit him. Yep. Okay. Yeah, he still has nothing on us though. Strange's gonna KO that. Okay. Even with me messing up, I still beat you. What's in here? Uh. Oh wow. Um. So I guess we'll take on the gym leader in this video. Might as well. There are more trainers out there, and I think we're fine on training, to be honest. Let's just get this over with. My Pokemon and I are bound together by friendship. Our bond will never be broken. So this is a fighting type gym, so you want to bring flying and psychic types in here. Um, especially, just for super effective damage, but... I mean, we packed this man with the best rare candies uh, the world's ever seen, so... <laughs> Uh, he's on steroids, man. I mean, we're, we're fine. Um, Black Machab, that's Cake. Uh, Machoke. Um, yeah, I really hope you guys are enjoying this episode so far, though, guys. I'm glad you guys are enjoying the series. A lot of support. I really appreciate it. I love doing the series. I like solo runs. It makes it uh, interesting. Makes makes more strategy become effective. And, uh... Yeah, I mean, you just have to learn how to navigate with only one Pokemon, which is really good. Um, strength? Um, that was easy. Man key, dead. Um, primate, dead. Okay, here's Chuck. Whoa! So you come this far. Let me tell you, I'm tough. My Pokemon will crush stones and shatter bones. Watch this! So he lets a boulder. There, scared now, are you? What? It has nothing to do with Pokemon? That's true. Come on, we shall do battle. So this is Jim Chuck. His first Pokemon is Primate, level 27. 
It will know the moves Leer, Rage, Karate Chop, and Fury Swipes. So Rage builds a power over time once you hit it. Fury Swipes hit multiple times and Karate Chop can flinch so, or has high critical hit ratio. So it's many strategies to leer you and just hit you for big damage, but we should be okay. Yeah, see? Polyrath, level 30. It's a water fighting type. It'll know the moves Hypnosis, Mind Reader, Surf, and Dynamic Punch. So Dynamic Punch is very, like, it can miss a lot, but once it hits you, it'll confuse you. And um, it'll use the move Mind Reader to uh, hit it. Um, and also Hypnosis to put you to sleep, and Surf is really good water, uh, uh, water type move, so... But, yeah, so took AMC, so he'll hit Dynamic Punch for now, but we should beat him in two turns, so that's not a big deal. What? Huh? I lost? How about that? You're worthy of the Storm Badge. Perfect. It also lets your Pokemon use Fly when you're not in battle. Here, take this too. This is Dynamic Punch. It, does not, it doesn't always hit, but when it does, it causes confusion. And if you talk to this lady... You crossed the sea to get here. That must have been hard. It would be much easier if your Pokemon knew how to fly. That's fine with Shim Badge. Then you should take this HM. Perfect. So I guess to end off the episode, we'll go back to, uh, uh, um, what, what's the city called? Olivine. Give the potion to, uh, Ampharos. And, uh, we'll bow to Gym Leader Jasmine next time. And get our 6th gym badge. So we're making really good progress in this game. Which is very good. Uh, so let's go back up to Lighthouse. Which should not take that long at all. Because I know where to go. Because I've been playing this game like a madman for years. You go up here. Down there. Down here. Down here. There we go. Will that medicine cure Amphi? Um, please don't be offended. Amphi will not take anything from anyone but me. Amphi, how are you feeling? Palu, Palu, Palu. Oh, I'm so relieved. This is just so wonderful. Thank you so very much. I'll return to the gym. We may be able to take... Let's just see how we do against her. We may be able to take her out real quick for the episode. Um, yeah, so I guess we might do two gym episodes. We beat her on the first try. And I guess I can't learn that. Never mind. Um, yeah, we might not win. But we'll try it. I'm just hoping strength does a good amount of that. Okay. Uh, Steelix is her strongest mon. Um, it's very, very good defensively, so I'd be really careful about that. Um, but here it is. It is a steel ground type Pokemon. Um, it's right here. It's level 35, and it will know the moves. Iron Tail, Rock Throw, Sunny Day, and Screech. So Sunny Day is going to lower the, its uh, water type weakness, and it'll just use Screech and Rock doing Iron Tail to beat you. So we're just going to go for uh, Attract. We're going to go for Counter. Hit us. Hit us. Oh, why did I do that? I'm an idiot. Oh, no. Hit us one more time. Do not kill us. Beautiful. We did it. All right. We should be okay. Dang it. We lost. Well, guys, I guess I'm going to grind a little bit, and uh, we'll beat her next time. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, guys. You guys have been making the OG Nation proud and building it up, and I'm so grateful for it. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys next time. Always God first, God bless. Have fun everything that you do, um, and you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you, and good night.